Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video of our chess and cubes. So guys, in today's video, I am going to teach you one of the first openings that I learned, which is the Spanish opening or the Ruy Lopez. So, the first move is 1 e4, e5, knight f3, and knight c6. Now you want to play your bishop to b5, and then there are two good moves for black. One is knight f6 another one is knight e7 now captures captures is a good option for black because the knight is regained and it is ahead in development but another really good move is knight to d4 captures captures and then bishop to d3 Knight f6 and castles. Now, most players will tend to play d6. Okay? But, d6 is a mistake because then the knight is pinned with the king. So, it's a really big mistake and you will not want to do that as white is ahead in development and has a slightly better position as it will soon uh, guard its pawn so after playing this what should you play as white this is from white's perspective so you should castle which is best for you uh, to bring your king to safety and then black players will tend to uh, be impatient and move the pawn forward to threaten your bishop so you take and they take getting double pawn and a not so really good pawn structure next you move your knight and develop it and they develop their bishop now your knight is pinned to the queen so you advance a pawn and when they attack with the queen then you should not be hasty and play this move bishop as bishop captures queen captures and then queen captures and you will lose your bishop so it is a bad move Instead, what you should play is moving forward the pawn, captures, 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 and you get double pawns, but this position is better than black's. So, it's winning for you. They long castle on the queen side, and then you threaten the rook, they defend the rook, and then you play your bishop back in hopes of attacking from behind. Okay, so the next thing that I am about to show you is what black should play the same pawn forward capture captures and then you move this forward and then capture with the bishop and stop the advancing of the d file pawn now the black will not like this and they will try to advance their knight to stop this but you should not let them and support the bishop with the rook then the bishop is trapped so they will try not trapped sorry but blocked so they will try to capitalize by moving the pawn then you capture this pawn and threaten the rook so the rook will be moved and then you capture and they capture then you capture and notice how you are in a really good position now the rook cannot capture because the knight is supported by the rook so suppose they play some random move then you can take this bishop and give check to the king and then the captures captures and it is a winning position for white so instead what black should play is removing the rook so after captures captures it is an equal position but black's position is worse and white is at the uh, advantage so this move is really good for white and this is the middle game i showed you some variations so keep watching till the next video bye